gonna do with that. That is a heavy duty piece of stuff right there. This in at 90 degrees. So. Ultimate bunk bed. All right, I got one bolt in each corner right, just to hold it in place. And you know what? I think that's a good day's work. I'm getting kind of hungry and it's getting close to dinner time. All right, bolt this down to here. Now when I have four of these rollers on this thing, one, two, three, four, it'll keep it from tilting that way. And I'll get some of these over there too. Um, although on that side, there's only gonna be two at the top because the bottom would be in the way of the motor because the motor's gonna slide under there. Yeah, that's right. Um, now to keep this thing from tilting that way, at the moment, it's just gonna rely on one of these here and one down there, and one there, one there. And that's gonna put a lot of pressure sideways and the bearing's pressing sideways against this. And actually, none of them, yeah, maybe that'll actually be all right. I was worried it would be too much friction, but it's gonna push on that pretty hard and it still rolls. Not too bad. Uh, although, later, the thing that lifts this up is gonna be attached on this side and that side. So it should lift uniformly from this side and that side. So that should keep this from tilting that way. Although it looks like these will be able to help. But mostly these just need to keep this from tilting this way. So that way I only need one thing here and one thing over there to lift the whole thing up. All right, so I need to make six of, six of these. Can I get six out of this? Oh. Oh, man. I don't know if I can get six out of this. Well, I can make another one of these out of some sheet metal, whatever. Maybe I can get four out of this. Okay, four of those. I can do the last two after I get these ones on. Oh, right. These only have one bolt in them going that way, which means I have to get these angles squared. All those. 
So I need to get it squared, put another bolt here and a cross piece and make sure all of these, everything is square before I start putting rollers in place. can actually attach rollers now and I lifted this up to be near the top because the rollers need to fit up here like perfectly if they're a little bit off down at the bottom it's fine because you know it can flex a millimeter or two down here but up here it's held you know rigidly in place so it needs to fit as perfectly as possible up at the top so And rolly things for that machine. this one. clamp on here and take that one off. Oh no, where's my net? Oh yeah. Wait, what? Hey, tiny fingers. Okay, take that screw. See right there, there's a washer. Put it right through that washer down into the thing. Good chance this will be fine with just one screw, but if I take my clamps off and test this and you know these twist, eh, it's gonna be a pain to get them lined up again. So I think I'll just put the, the second screw in right now, even though I probably I don't know. 
I'll just put it in to make sure. All right, skinny fingers. You see this hole here? It's that, well, you can look, look right there, that hole. You think you can get this screw up from under? And then I'll get the, the nut on top. If you, if you get it in there, keep your finger pushing it up to hold it. <laughs> you might have to hold it funny to get it in there, like between two fingers or something. Oh, oh, yeah, like that. Like, oh my god, you're gonna get it. You just gotta get it lined up right. I can't. Okay. Oh, you're so close. Uh, back toward you a tiny bit. You almost got it. Toward you a tiny bit. No, that way a bit. Okay, now that way a bit. No, no, that way. That way. That way, that way, that way. You're right on, you're pushing on the edge of it. Okay, now go that way. <laughs> Wait, almost that way a bit, tiny bit, tiny bit, tiny bit. No, that way, that way. Back up, toward, toward you, toward you. Okay, now push up, wait. Oh, okay, that way a tiny bit. It's right there, it's right there. Oh yeah, you got it, oh, oh gosh, oh gosh. All right, I better put that on the camera. Oh, right there, right there. Okay, hold it there. Oh, did you get it? from the other side. Uh, yeah, even with uh, just, this, just the bearings on this side, it's pretty good. So maybe I unbolt this, put a couple washers, spacers in there to get this up a little bit so it's not hitting. Yeah, that's what it's hitting right there. All right. All right, that's a minor fix. Okay, so take these off, put two washers in there, and then put those back in. But I have to get to the nuts that are inside. I'm not going to reach all the way down from the top. So I need to tip this whole thing up so I can get my hand up in there. All right, that's not that big a fix. All right, we're going to, we're going to lean this thing against. Oh, these are different lengths. Oh. Oh, this is stupid. This piece is like kind of behind under this, so I can't pull it out without it shifting. So I need to get my hacksaw, just take off a little sliver off this. Uh, do you think one will be enough or do we need to put two in there? I think one layer of washers will be enough. Oh, I should put the screw in before that falls. another washer in there. I don't know, I think it's fine. There can be a little friction. A little friction's good, because I don't want this to ever 
move quickly anyway. Um, so that's one, two, three, four bearing thingies on this side. And I'm thinking, even though that side doesn't have a piece under there, I want to put one, two, and then just put two more on the ends of these. 